We got tipped off to this next story on social media. A local mom says she got fired from her job at a local restaurant because she left work to get a mammogram. Her story is creating a firestorm on Facebook, and we wanted to learn more about what may have went wrong. 27 First News reporter Gio Ricciuti has reaction from both sides. For Jamie Kreitzer, the ordeal began a month ago when she first found a lump in her breast. Two weeks later, after talking with a doctor, she scheduled a mammogram and an ultrasound and told her bosses at the Hickory Grill in Hermitage she'd need a day off. I let uh, the general manager know and I also let one of the other assistant managers know what was going on um, on the medical side of it and also about the appointments and about a cancellation. Although her tests were scheduled for June 15th, on Monday, Kreitzer was called at work and learned there had been a last-minute cancellation and her mammogram could be done that day. She went to her manager and asked if she could leave work for an hour in the middle of her shift. She just said, you know, you're going to do whatever you want, and this is job abandonment, and she kept telling me that. Still, Kreitzer left, had the tests done, and went home, reporting for work as usual Tuesday. That's when the 30-year-old single mom was told she had lost her job. They felt that I left them with a skeleton shift during lunch, and then since they already knew that I had an appointment the following week, they felt I could have waited. Late this afternoon, we received an email from the company that runs Hickory Grill, stating while they could not comment on this particular occurrence, they claim all personnel actions were taken in complete accordance with proper personnel management, adding later in the statement, we care deeply for our employees and their families. Ironically, Kreitzer tells me the test results showed her lump was benign. It's unfortunate. I'm sorry that I lost my job over being proactive for my health. Afterward, Kreitzer says she began questioning her decision and decided to post a message on Facebook looking for some support and encouragement from her friends. In less than a day, her post has been shared nearly 2,000 times. It's very, I mean, it's extremely emotionally overwhelming. She says the reaction gives her some reassurance she made the right decision. She's now hoping to land another job to pay the bills and support her son. In Hermitage, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.